Hey, you made it once again. Come join us as we try some Christmas beers. Hey, I'm John Campbell. I'm Camilla Campbell. And this is Campbell's and Beer. Beer. And hey, you joined us as we're going through the beers of Christmas. And it all started, as we've talked about, with the Costco Brewers Advent. And they have all kinds of German beers. And today we're going to go through this one here, which is the Schwartz Tint Collab Stout. Camilla, what do you got? I have clown shoes. They're pecan type porter. Mm. And look at that can art. And it's brewed, brewed with coffee. So this oh. is um, Genghis pecan on the, <laughs> on the front. Nice. Genghis Pecan. It's a cold evening, so yes. I've got a, a nice dark beer to warm up would be good. Is it dark? Ooh, the head's really dark. Wow, that is a dark beer. Really dark looking head. It smells like coffee. You get anything else on it? That's a rich, rich beer. Do you I get don't... sweetness, like a pecan no, flavor I on don't, it? No, I don't get a lot of pecan, actually. Definitely a Just strong coffee. coffee. Yeah. And it's a brown ale? Yes. I get some chocolate. Yeah, I get some sweetness on it. I don't get, I don't get pecan. I get like a sweet chocolate coffee. Like I would imagine a coffee stout to be that's what that tastes this, like to me this is a pecan pie porter it's a pecan pie porter so how would you rate it another sip no you're not allowed to drink beer on this i would say three and a half okay it's not necessarily my first choice in style but for being a porter it is tasty would you drink it again yes we were we were looking at this Schwartz Tint collab. It looks like a bunch of ink dripped all over the can. There's two breweries in Germany. I'll link them in the the comments down below. There's no way I'm pronouncing those brewery names um, again for all of our German friends. You're more than welcome to do that. And uh, this is called a stout. Man, look at that. That is dark. Uh, tight little head on that, um, but uh, not a lot on the aroma. Definitely no hoppy smell. Huh. Wow. That is a really light beer. I would almost call that like a black pilsner. I, I don't get stout on that at all. I mean, that's a really mellow beer, except for a little bit of um, some maltiness. Um, not even roast on that. Um, I, I mean, if you didn't see the color, you'd think you're pouring just like a little bit of a caramely stout, uh, Pilsner. Yeah? Yeah, that's exactly. Yeah, this, this one definitely has more of a body more complexity to it this yeah. is really really light really easy that's a drip down my face um just not a lot going on i mean a little bit of a little bit of coffee on that so yeah i don't know that one might have to sit around on that one a little bit i i'm probably if i were to rate this right now i'd probably give it a two and a half maybe out of five so it's not ne necessarily something that i would want to try again but uh, most of them have been great so far. Yours, most of them have been really. Are you distracted at all? Is <laughs> a little it, bit. A little bit. Um, but uh, most of them have been been pleasing. Something that you know I've enjoyed. This is maybe not so much so far out of, out of all the ones that are on the Brewers Advent. All the all the Stone and Clown shoes have been good, right? Well, once again, 
we're glad you're here that you made it that you found us please comment um, let us know what you think are you a stout drinker are you a are you a pecan brown drinker um, glad to have you here make sure that you you subscribe ring the bell if you'd like to hear more content around different brews that we're trying and we're enjoying thanks so much cheers cheers